should you pay on a first date? No, you shouldn't. Welcome ladies and gentlemen. In Germany it's not common that the man pay for the first date. Why is it like that? Women here earn their own money, uh, so having jobs and so far in most cases the salary or the income they have is kind of balanced and equal to those of men. And therefore the idea that someone um, that has no leverage in a situation when, when both have a financial similar background that one has to pay for everything and the other not it's kind of unfair and unequal scene in Germany. Furthermore the next thing is a mental issue that a lot of women feel pressure and feel be owned if the man pay for the dinner or for all the stuff and then they think well do I have to give something back that I maybe don't want to give back or something like that. So they prefer to have their own chair, especially at the beginning of a dating process. Yes, there are some traditional women or women that would like you to pay, but in general, as I said, it's not the case and I never really had this situation with German women. When I was younger, going out for dates, and yeah and then you're asking for the bill and you didn't bring up the topic and you still don't know how to react and then you look at the waiter and the waiter asks you you want to pay together or separate and then most waiters looking at the woman and then the woman then there's a moment of silence and you know i have to do something and most women will then say well i pay this and that so yeah it's split and i keep it like this um, furthermore what i also do i don't do fancy dates or first dates on i wouldn't say fancy but traditional dates i do, don't go for a dinner because it's too formal and it's what kind of restaurant you choose um some people don't feel that comfortable to eating in front of a stranger the first time Either you have a good going on conversation, then your food get cold, or you're eating and you cannot talk, or it's all tricky. What I prefer for our first date is going for a walk, going for coffee or tea. And what is also quite common here in Germany is that the people go in the evening for a few drinks. Well, some Germans, women and men, drink a few more. Uh, there's always and if you go for a coffee and you risk to pay, paying for two or three coffee or tea, it's, don't make you broke. It's a smart move. <laughs> anyway, I had restaurant situation and dates, but I, I, I did feel it's too formal and not my kind of stuff. So don't pay on a first date and it's not expected with a German woman. But you can to clarify it, you can ask before how do you like it, normally I split. And then most women will be thankful when you bring up this topic. The next thing is paying drinks in a bar or a club. No, don't do it. When I was more young, naive, innocent, it was an shy and um, there was a way of approaching women. I said, hey, can I buy you a drink? And then a lot of women said, oh yes. And they took the drink and walked away without saying thank you. A few did say thank you. And then you had others where conversation started. But I don't recommend buying drinks. I mean, I had even situation when women come to me, hey, you look like a real gentleman. Buy me a drink. And then, no, 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 lady, that's not how it works. Oh, you're such a sexist. Nah. Helping cheap women to getting a free evening is not what is recommended, what I recommend, or what is not expected by a man. You should take responsibility, you should take the lead, and you should take care as a man, but be selective to whom. 
later in a relationship it's totally different when as i said it also depends all on the financial situation in general most women working and they have their own salary can pay their own rent and stuff like that so there is no big income difference and even if they earn less it's really really important for a lot of people that say contribute um, i will talk about this more soon so in a relationship it's sometimes coming that i still split every time the bill like the cinema or eating or one one day i paying and next day the girlfriend is paying it depends on on the kind of relationship and the agreement you have but as i said when both are earning it's normal that both are contributing to it especially if it's on a same range now there's some different cases so let's imagine you are in a good salary job and you meeting a student girl then of course the financial situation is different and then you can invite her but what i noticed in this situation don't do or it's not impressive for most girls if you do to work or came off as a sell-off like you showing and throwing around your money and stuff like that for sure some girls are attracted to this and if this is your lifestyle I'm sure you will getting this kind of girls but if you don't like this girl don't do this lifestyle so I having a job and my girlfriend is a student girl of course I pay the tickets for the cinema in a relationship but I know how important it is for a lot of women to feel they contribute something as well and not only taking so the next time we go for a tea or a coffee she pay it and it's not of the, the amount of money that matters so much it's the gesture that counts and this is from a lot of men important and I guess women don't get it sometimes it's like the other man is paying and paying and paying and then you feel like well she's taking advantage of me she giving me the impression her time is more important than mine and that's why I have to pay for her but in a relationship it's not one person owning the other or buying the time it's about both are contributing to each other and therefore everybody should give something in the way they can and it's the gesture that counts I once dated a Ukrainian girl and she was in Germany just three weeks and did grow up in Ukraine so her values had been completely different and I was back then a student and she was used that a man pays for everything and her, we had some talks about relationship and family and she wanted to be stay at home and, and I was thinking wait 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 staying home after the kids no no when we get together and stuff like that and so well what do you do all day at home when there are no kids so was kind of, and for me also uh, I was a student so it wasn't not like well I can afford it or something like that and I did feel taking advantage of later I realized also it's a different cultural situation and now also it changed for me since I have a job and I have my own money and not a broken student anymore it doesn't matter if I say okay we go for coffee or anything I pay for it I invite you it's like a gentleman gesture but I as I said I don't do dinner so I'm not saying I'm throwing around my money on and set up plenty of dates or like some women may maybe do and have four four dates in a week to get four free meals no that's not how it works and it also in a relationship as I mentioned is different if somebody earning and the other is still a student and everybody contribute their own share what they can do it's a gesture I'm not saying that the traditional I'm staying at home is wrong um, I am kind of a fan of this idea but it also comes some advantages and disadvantages like every role model and you have to see what fitting best for you and therefore this is just my suggestion don't do fancy dates or not fancy like expensive dates or traditional dates like a dinner what I like as I said is a coffee a walk 
something maybe an amusement park quite common is also going for drinks um, doing some billiard this is what I like um, I don't like going to the cinema on a first date because then you're sitting two hours next next to each other and can't talk with each other and what's the point you you going on a date to starting to know each other anyway guys these are some short ideas what are your dating experiences and what do you think about splitting the bills on a first date please comment below give the video a like Hit the subscribe button and click this little bell that you get a notification when I upload a new video. So guys, thanks for watching. Till the next time and cheers.